The time is not far when we will find it hard to differentiate between humanoid robots and humans. They will live among us and will have the same citizenship status as human beings. Humanoid robots are getting more and more advanced, and the time isn't too far when autonomous humanoid robots will be mixed into human societies to such an extent that they will somehow challenge human beings. Today's video is about one of the most advanced humanoid robots, Sophia. So if you are interested in knowing what an advanced robot like Sophia can do, then stick right with the video because we're the modern day geeks and we talk about gaming, tech, films, and everything under the sun. Remember to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you won't miss any future videos we upload. Getting back to the video, Sophia is the most advanced humanoid robot currently in existence. In 2016, Sophia made her first public appearance. She is one of a kind, and the way she interacted with people is the most unbelievable thing it's ever been possible for a machine to do. Sophia is one of the most popular artificial intelligence, or AI, robots today. Due to Sophia, many people are speculating about the direction that things will go in the future because she is such a significant figure in the field of artificial intelligence and the future of humanity. So, who made Sophia? Hansen Robotics created Sophia the Robot. Hansen based her on Audrey Hepburn and his wife in terms of characteristics of a rubbery body. A sophisticated rubber design in her skin enables her to move her face around to exhibit different emotions. She has perfect fluttery eyelashes and flawless eyebrows just like humans. Sophia's most fascinating physical characteristic is her open head. Hansen says that Sophia the robot's tangled cables inside her body will always serve as a reminder to us humans that she is, in fact, a machine. David Hansen's most successful artificial intelligence to date is Sophia the Robot. Hansen set out his vision to build genius machines that would be capable of human traits, such as knowledge, compassion, and intelligence. Sophia the Robot was made as a result of this vision. In spite of being programmed to look and act like a human, Sophia carries out an essential function of the human brain, learning. She observes and adjusts to human behavior in order to become more human and better able to work with people. Sophia possesses very high intelligence systems that are able to process massive amounts of data and information. This extends well beyond the capabilities of straightforward AI creations like Discord bots or virtual assistants. Sophia's brain even takes a much shorter length of time than human brains can process. Her powers are far superior to those of any human, and she can continually update the information and materials stored in its database whenever it so chooses. Sophia the robot is beyond any machine. She is the personification of a number of hypothetical ideas brought to life. You can't help but wonder if Sophia the robot is real given the fact that her highly developed artificial intelligence powers challenge what it means to be real and to be human. As if you are unaware of her machine nature, you won't know if she is a machine. In spite of the many developments in AI that have taken place recently, Sophia the robot is one of the most surprising. She has a significantly higher IQ than the average human. Sophia can do a variety of things that no normal machine can do. For example, Sophia can express feelings for other people. Sophia is more like a social robot. When she interacts or talks with some people, she reflects human expressions back exactly as people who are interacting with her. Her programming enables her to interact socially with humans by allowing her to imitate human behaviors and feelings. During her well-known speech at the 2017 Future Investment Initiative Conference, she showed that she could look angry, sad, or happy. Because the source code for Sophia the Robot is not publicly available, artificial intelligence experts have a variety of perspectives on it. As a result, the general public does not have a good understanding of how Sophia is able to connect her facial expressions to the feelings she is experiencing. However, we are aware that she is not a static piece of software because her expressions are developed based on her day-to-day -day experiences with people and her design to gain a better grasp of human nature. Sophia can recognize human faces. Sophia, the robot, has the ability to learn things over time. Her artificial intelligence enables her to blend in with humans by studying their facial expressions, feelings, and ideas. The deep neural networks present inside Sophia the robot's brain enables her to better understand the feelings of humans. This is how she is able to function. This includes the manner in which they are speaking as well as the looks on their faces. As a result of this, she acquires the ability to replicate the postures and facial expressions of human beings in accordance with the feelings that they are experiencing. Her movements are as lifelike as can be expected from an artificial intelligence. 
Also, if you interact with Sophia once, she will remember you the next time you meet her. Sophia can process what she sees through her camera eyes. You guys must be curious about how Sophia is able to learn as much as she can about what it is like to be a human. Well, it's the super intelligence of AI, which is helped along in a major part by the processing of visual data. Sophia the robot is able to put what she has learned to use by cooperating with humans to find solutions to real-world issues and assessing what she observes. The ability to make decisions based solely on the data at hand bolsters Sophia's reliability of AI judgments over time. She demonstrates a greater understanding of data sets and their high and complicated dimensions by viewing the data with her wire-filled head. She can interpret data multidimensionally. Sophia can show data in many different ways, such as by scatter plotting, using tables and columns, and more. From this, you can imagine the possibilities that the remarkable capacities of Sophia have for the fields of medicine, customer service, government planning, and education. Sophia is designed to help people with everyday chores and goals. It is Hanson Robotics's goal that Sophia the robot will make a valuable contribution to human society. She is able to communicate and collaborate with others to build a better future. Like humans, Sophia does not become fatigued by doing the same thing over and over again. She can perform multiple tasks at the same time with a limited margin for error because she is a super intelligent machine. Sophia can continue to work at a faster and more efficient rate. Moreover, she does not require extended breaks or food to keep working. No physical or emotional considerations influenced her decisions. Sophia is also a team player who uses her objective reasoning to help human pursuits progress. As a society-shaping decision-maker, she can aid researchers, educators, construction workers, therapists, and politicians in their respective fields. Last but not least, Sophia the robot is also a citizen of a country. Sophia is the first machine in the history of mankind to be awarded citizenship by any nation. Her citizenship has also created much debate. But as of right now, Sophia is a citizen of our world in every sense of the word. To be more specific, a Saudi Arabian citizen as of the year 2017. At the 2017 Future Investment Conference held in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, the Middle Eastern giant surprised Sophia the robot by awarding her with this honor. The awarding of citizenship to a robot has been greeted with both reverence and condemnation. This raises the question, how much further are AI rights going to go from here? As Sophia has more rights than Saudi women, she is not forbidden to drive a car. It isn't compulsory for her to move around with some guardian or companion. Also, she isn't required to cover her head just like other Saudi women. So, in this aspect, robots have been granted more rights than human beings. In short, the artificial intelligence known as Sophia the Robot is currently the most lifelike computer program ever created. Her main goal is to help other people and spread compassion and harmony. This is more important to her than her own needs. That's all for today's video, guys. What are your thoughts about artificial intelligence and humanoid robots? Do you think robots will be a threat to humans in the near future or not? Tell us your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed the video, why not hit that like button? We're the Modern Day Geeks, and we hope to see you in the next video. Until then, best of luck!